This is absolutely beyond ridiculous and shows just how spineless Dwayne Johnson is. This whole thing is absolutely insane what he said here on the Joe Rogan podcast. And it shows just how fake and pathetic so many Hollywood celebrities are, especially bigger names like Dwayne Johnson. And it's already cringy enough what Dwayne Johnson tells Joe Rogan here. We're going to be getting into all of that. But we're also going to be completely exposing Dwayne Johnson after we watch this clip. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. When I was a kid... You can have a Republican friend. Like, it, d it was no big deal. <laughs> yes, yes. It's no big deal. Like, oh, Bobby likes George Bush. Of Who course. cares? Who gives right. a fuck? You know, you were a supporter of Bill Clinton. He liked George Bush. Nobody cared. Nobody like, fuck you. You yeah. know, it wasn't like... And you, you can hear just Dwayne Johnson just being like, yeah, yeah, totally, man. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, totally. Like, you're a Nazi. Like, I'm a, what am I, I'm a Nazi. I just want lower taxes. That's <laughs> what the f*** are you talking saying? about? How did I become a Nazi? Dude, it's, a, it's the craziest thing. I have friends who support Trump. I have friends who support Biden. I have friends. Do you really have friends who support Biden? Oh, man. Biden? Oh, man, guys. Dwayne Johnson is... He, <laughs> He, he's not for either side, my friends. He, Dwayne Johnson is just, he is he is a very balanced person, right? Like, he would never do something crazy like, you know, ostracize people who are Trump supporters. Never! He would never do something like that, right? Well, we have a lot to get into with that in just a little bit here. I have friends. Do you really have friends who support Biden? I do. <laughs> Come well, on. No, 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 no. Here's, here's what I do. I have, I have friends... <laughs> Thank you. That's a good check because that's important. <laughs> this is important context. They support the. Um. Yeah. So Dwayne Johnson apparently doesn't have any friends that support Biden, except for well, himself, because he supported Biden. I have friends who are loyal to the party. Yes. I, I'm not a fan of Democrats. I've never voted for a Democrat in my life. And But there's a lot of Republicans that I would never just vote for just because I'm voting for the party as well. So check everyone that you're voting for. Do your research, please. But we are going to completely expose Dwayne Johnson. It's hilarious because this is based on a video that I posted during the 2020 election where Dwayne Johnson himself came out to endorse Joe Biden for president. And it was my biggest video of that time. It got over 2 million views on the channel. And so this is just crazy, man, because we're going to be taking a little bit of a step back in time here to take a look at this, okay? Because apparently Dwayne Johnson thinks that we all have the memory of a goldfish. We're going to go ahead and prove him wrong here. So just remember that Dwayne Johnson said that he doesn't have any friends that support Biden. Right, okay. Um, Dwayne The Rock Johnson just made a big step when he endorsed Democratic presidential nominee Joe Biden because, Melissa, this is not something that he has done before. No. Oh, so wait. So Dwayne Johnson endorsed Joe Biden. Huh. You couldn't tell that from this clip here with with uh joe rogan you couldn't tell any of that because it looks like that uh, dwayne johnson is just like oh <laughs> imagine imagine supporting biden <laughs> you can, wouldn't be me well we got the truth we got the truth here guys dwayne the rock johnson took to social media to make his first political endorsement for the democratic presidential nominee huh interesting interesting let's hear what he has to say i do feel that vice president biden and senator harris are the best choice to lead our country, and I am endorsing them to become president and vice president of our United States. Sounds like a Biden supporter to me. Maybe he doesn't have any friends that support Biden, but he sure did, didn't he? We all remember the truth. We remember what he said during the 2020 election. At the end of the day, he has to be beholden to the Hollywood elites. Let me know what you think about this in the comments below. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.